All right, everyone. So this is going to be a Pisces Sun Moon and as well a Rising Weekly Tarot, um, Weekly Career and um, Business Tarot reading for February 10th to 16th, uh, 2020. And um, in case you are interested into a, a personal reading with me, you can check out uh, the description, the description down below, and there you are going to find a, a link to my website, as well as uh, also there you are going to find a, a link to your love and relationship tarot reading as well. So that being said, guys, moving into the uh, career and business uh, tarot reading for you, Pisces. Now the first card that we do have, which signifies the topic of uh, this business uh, week is going to be the five of cups followed by the next one which represents uh, the uh, energies that are supporting the topic for you uh, that will be the four of cups followed by the next one here which is uh, the challenges that you will need to overcome throughout the week that is to be the three of cups then uh, we do have a uh, the gifts and the blessings that you can enjoy for throughout the week in terms of business and career that will be the hermit card followed by the next one which is how people are gonna take on you meaning what kind of an impression you're gonna give into the people around your colleagues your supervisor uh, your boss and etc etc that is to be the full card which is by the way the most important one here and the final one is going to be the guidance that uh, Tara is offering you in terms of a business and career that is to be the seven of pentacles lovely so uh, we do have the first couple of cards here which stands as the topic and the energies and unfortunately into your career the energies on their own accord that is are pointing that not many things are going to start unfolding in a sense of that newness yes you're going to have a good performance into your current projects yes you're going to have a uh, how can i say it a, a productive week based on the current plan but unfortunately with this card a nothing new comes around or it's coming on your own um on your own platter on your own or on its own accord therefore uh, with those energies it is expected from you to do something about to make a new things happening into your career say you're looking for job these cards means that that job is not gonna find you you actually have to start looking for it you on your own accord and it's because the four of cups is a uh, energy it's a bit of a uh, difficult card to overcome it kind of like talks about the current circumstances and how one is finding um, solace into the current circumstances unwilling to kind of look around and scope a new opportunity so these are the energies and they are feeding up the situation of the five of uh, of the five of, of cups excuse me which speaks about resignation what i mean is that whatever happens happens i'm fine you know and uh, you know eventually you know things are gonna get better and eventually i gonna i, I got i will have my moment now while that can be true you can definitely force the moment throughout this week and as you are to force the moment well obviously you are to force them to force the moment on your own terms instead of waiting the moment to be forced on its own terms now uh on it or from another look of those cards we can talk about a, a bit of failure that you may experience throughout the week in terms of a career and business, but that failure is not going to be your failure. What I mean it is that, for example, someone else failed or someone else neglected certain important matters that could be to, uh, that uh, should have been attended to, or someone else a, took a job that it was beyond the limits of the company that you are uh, working for or the business that you are working for and now unfortunately you can't meet the expectations of the client or of your boss or you can't fulfill the deadline here with those cards now if that's the case this uh, setback and this um, how can i say it uh, this loss would you say is going to be just something temporary it's not going to be permanent so definitely afterwards you should not kind of like judge the evening by the morning that happens so you definitely gonna have a time to recuperate moving forward into the future and to kind of like uh, sustain you know to bring back that project or that deed 
uh, on its feet once the time is right. But unfortunately, once again, this week, Pisces, you have to prepare yourself for some, um, I would say, boring week in terms of uh, business and career, unless you don't force yourself, step out of your comfort zone and do something to amuse yourself in there with projects and with a, uh, with tasks. Now, the other card that we do have here, guys, is going to be uh, the challenges that you need to overcome. That will be the Tree of Cups. And uh, it doesn't look like that your co-workers or your clients or the people that you are working with in general are going to share to its maximum extent your vision, meaning that you may face a bit of opposition and contradictory, if you will, with the people that you are working with or with the people that you are working for. So what we do have here with the Tree of Cups is that we do have a mismatching of a uh, expectations we do have mismatching as well of a goal as well and it's kind of like it doesn't look like that you and the people that are surrounding you into your career are on the same level with emotional connection if you will to the job that you are doing so for example you do care a lot well those around you doesn't care that much as you do and that kind of like provokes those kind of like feelings of um of dread, if you will, within you of a, um, I don't know how to describe it really, of annoyment, you know, how those that are around me does not care about that thing, it's about to fall into ruin. Well, believe it or not, people take their, their job as work and not as a competition. So you do what you can and you don't push yourself because at the end of the day, you're going to get your salary, don't you, uh, regardless of what you do. Now, Important thing to be acknowledged with the Tree of uh, Cups as well, it is that uh, when you do something into your career in a term of, you know, performance, so say uh, a new project is given to you or you are starting a new job this week, uh, you are not going to see immediate results from your performance. And that should not be a prerequisite from you, uh, for you to kind of like a, uh, if you will, drop down into spirit i don't know how to say it but let's say let think the less of you it's just it's gonna take a little bit more time for uh the uh the results of your work to actually kick in so do not despair if that's your case now next one it is the gifts and the blessings that you are to experience throughout this week in term of a career so we do have the hermit and say you find a job now that is your substantial job, probably a job where you have a pretty good chance to retire in. So uh, whatever uh, circumstances you are to provoke, although the week is going to be quite boring, those circumstances are going to be yours to play with. Okay, and nothing can takes can takes away that thing from you. Now, additionally to that, hermit points that you are to be exceptionally intelligent and wise when it comes to uh, tackling with projects and tackling with um, with challenges, especially, and also correlates very well with the. Um, Challenges it is because the hermit acts alone and whatever uh, the, the, the hermit uh, decides to do something usually there's there aren't many people to applaud them going into that direction. So that being said, well, wherever you face the most opposition and wherever you are facing the least support from those that you are working with, this is exactly the direction that, that you need to go so remember here as the hermit is the gifts and the blessings that means that whatever you create in this week whatever project you start okay whatever circumstances you force uh whomever you get befriended into your career as a co-worker now that thing appears to be very very substantial asset for you moving forward into the future so just to summarize that guys before we go to the last two cards yes the week is to be boring yes the week in term of career may gonna face certain disappointments here and there but that doesn't mean that you have to fail in it that doesn't mean that you don't have to do something for yourself as well so career wise here try to uh i would say try to stand for yourself and involve yourself on your own accord into the projects and into the tasks that you are finding um, productive, that you are finding substantial and that you are finding 
cost effective that is your gift and blessings and blessing that you do that you can involve yourself into those things uh, and then uh, we are going into how people are seeing you you know what kind of an impression you're giving into people we do have the the uh, full card so that is a good impression that you are making into your boss and into your supervisor and bad impression that you are making into your coworkers. so what the card here points as a follow-up to the previous cards it is that your boss and your supervisor uh, are kind of seeing you uh, not determined but ready to sign for more it's kind of like that you need to expand into your career to excel there and therefore they are going to start considering giving you bigger tasks bigger responsibilities bigger projects and who knows where that is going to lead up because the fool kind of uh, promises you that there are to be further involvement there but unfortunately it doesn't say is it going to be successful or is it gonna lead into something new all right so that being said here Pisces you can expect very soon after the week ends to be approached by your boss and by your, by your supervisor with a proposition for a something uh, new that the company is attending to, for example, a new service that is going to offer, a new project that comes around, and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. So you can expect to be the leading uh, the leading force into uh, into that field. However, uh, your coworkers are not going to be happy of uh, that particular standpoint of yours. Not because you're going to be granted it with the new uh, project or with the new task but it's because they are seeing you quite unresponsible or irresponsible that is to the current tasks that are lying ahead so they are seeing you like a person who is bailing out person who is abandoning them person who is uh, uh, kind of like making them or letting them stranding into the current task that the company is working so the, the, this this week for you Pisces it is a week where you I will say it that way where you are f consuming the final fruits or the previous labor of yours and now it's time for you to think of and ask for as well a new uh, fruits or kind of like a new labor field so you can reap a new fruit of that particular labor and finally we do have the guidance that Taro is offering that is to be the seven of pentacles so quite correlating with uh, the gifts and the blessings of the hermits and you have to be very careful what you're wishing for here guys with the seven of pentacles takes your time to decide what kind of a, a project you want to go for what kind of a task what you ask from your uh, supervisor what to ask from your boss as well as a uh, for example promotion or as a salary because it's going to come with its own circumstances and therefore whatever you want to go for whatever you you decide to go for or whatever job you want to jump into working that job or this project or this deed need to be fully cost effective meaning that you have to get more from it than that you are going to put into additionally to that the seven of pentacles points that there are to be some surprises throughout the week so don't be biased of any any kind of situations especially when you are taunted by your co-workers and within an attempt so you can be intimidated so that being said Pisces this was your weekly career and business style reading hopefully you enjoyed it and you liked it guys and uh, we're going to see each other next time until then bye